it was cold last night. As you guys see from the videos, the uh, mountains are full of snow. That's from the storm. We get that every winter. We'll have like a week or two of like just winter and it drops all the snow at one time, you know? And uh, what's really alarming is you see these homeless people out here and um, you can't force somebody where they don't want to go, but uh, some of them, you'll see all the stuff that they have in their basket, like their clothes and stuff. They'll like sleep underneath all of that and all this cold. It just, it's, it's kind of sad because you want to help, but you know, again, you can't force people to do something they don't want to do. And when I was in Alaska, what would happen is like, let's say the native Indians would uh, get drunk because they're susceptible to, you know, something in their system, just like black, you know, people. But in Indians especially, they're susceptible to uh, alcohol or whatever it is. And in Alaska, what was happening was these Indians would get drunk and they would fall, fall out, right? Or just pass out or just sit down and whatever. And then that night, the snow would fall on them. And you won't find them until the spring and the thaw. So it's not unusual to be in Alaska and they find a, a dead body, a frozen body during the thaw. And when I first got up there, that just affected me so badly because being from California, Southern California, I had never experienced anything like that. So um, I kind of think about that when I see the homeless people out here because it gets extremely cold. I, I'll be in my house and I have a smart thermostat and everything. You know, I'll put on some you know clothes or whatever, but I like to sleep under heavy blankets. And so I turn the heater off sometimes, but sometimes I don't because the house could get that cold. And, um, you know, I just kind of worry about them. So, yeah. All right. You guys have a great day.